In this video, we're going to talk about what Avenge has just come out with, with their Aven Axe Avenge Pro Power U-Trip Baseball Bat. So let's talk, talk about it. So we're going to talk today about the Axe Avenge Pro Power U-Triple-SA Baseball Bat. So if you guys aren't familiar with what axe is or what kind of axe bats they are, so these are the bats that have that axe handle at the bottom. So they really started out earlier in their manufacturing a couple years ago where the, the bat would actually look like an axe handle. So um, they came out with a different modification to that. So it still is a flared handle a bit, but not as um, aggressive as an axe handle at the bottom. So today we're going to take a look at their newest offering for U-Trip. It's called the Axe Avenge Pro Power, and it's got a new paint job. So let's take a look at it on here. Um, so it definitely has a, a Easton-esque uh, paint job on that for the ADV, but I like the colors. It kind of has a really cool hand hole on it. It says goat on the handle here. <laughs> so I love that. And there's that, that flared handle that I'm talking about. So in axes manufacturing and why they did that it helps prevent a rollover effect of the hand um so i get it i've actually swung the axe bats and i've actually you know for a home run derby that i actually was in and i love it it helps me stay nice and focused i mean a lot of people can attest that okay well if if it's if it's shaped like that you can only hit on one side of the bat which is true so axe has double wall their barrels and, and kind of has a lot of technology behind that so to help prevent you know any stress on that one side of the bat so yeah there's that there's a you know a good shot of it um it does come in a drop 10 and a drop eight no drop five yet i don't know if they're going to come out with that or not but um i've been in talks with axe and i'm actually i have one coming in that i'm going to be testing so really good looking bat i love the color scheme i love that that handle it says goat on it which is which is awesome and, you know, the performance of these bats, I've always, since their last blue and white one, has been awesome. It's it's kind of like a, a sleeper bat that a lot of people don't know about. You know, it's not as big as a brand as, you know, Easton, Louisville, you know, Marucci, all that kind of stuff. So definitely give it a look. I'm going to be testing it with my son. My son's a 9U player. So we're going to go with the 10, the, the drop 10. Um, it does come in the drop 10 and drop eight. And in the drop 10, it comes in a 29, 30 and 31 and the drop eight. It comes in a 29, 30 and 31 as well. And you can see this bat is selling well for them. So definitely take a look at that. It is considered, you know, the, the new goat. And they, you know, that was what they're saying. They're saying it's a juiced bat. So here's a brand video. video for there you guys go it is a three-piece composite if i haven't said that already so it's definitely composite you can hear it when it you know the sound of the bat it's got that hyper whip end cap too to help prevent you know friction in the swing so definitely take a look at that if you're in the market um it, it i guarantee it's going to be one of the best bats here um you know top three top five bat so definitely take a look so I'm excited for that bat. Let me know if you guys get it and leave your comments below. I'm telling you, tell me if you like it or not. I'll be posting an uh, uh, on-field review later in this in this series of videos of bat reviews. So I appreciate you guys watching. Please subscribe to the channel. We have hit 1,300 subscribers. We have hit it, but I want to get to 2,000. My two, 2,000 by the end of the year is my goal. So if you're you know into baseball, youth baseball, baseball bats, youth mentality of baseball subscribe help me out leave a comment give me a thumbs up i appreciate all the love i appreciate it thanks guys